Joe. In both the last UK and US elections, there was conversation about wiping student debt. Uh, do you think there's any chance it could happen? I don't think it's going to happen. And if it happens, there's going to be a caveat in there. Right? The one way they're going to do this great reset, they're going to try to do this great reset. Right? They're going to say, they're going to come out, centralized power, and to students as well. All right, they're going to come out and say, okay, we're going to wipe your debt clean. All right? Let's say you, me, have a lot of debt or a lot for us. Right? We have a lot of debt, no job prospect, economy is down the toilet. Right? The only jobs you can get are Taco Bell or McDonald's or digging ditches. Some of it at minimum wage, some of it below minimum wage, some of it above minimum wage. I've heard on some of the fast food places, they're actually paying like $18 an hour, right? What the hell is $18 an hour going to get you, right? They're paying a lot more above minimum wage because they can't find anyone to do the work, right? So let's assume we're in that situation. We have debt and there's no way to pay it. And it's student debt or debt that we can't write off or don't want to write off. Centralized power says we're going to wipe your debt right sign here as soon as you sign here you're free of debt you have no debt but but you agree not to never own a home never have a bank account that goes above five thousand dollars right or ten thousand dollars or something like this right you will never own anything okay because you sign this contract it means we wiped your debt clean we did you a favor in return it means you will not be allowed to own anything right so they could add those things in there okay you will have to rent your car in these carpools that we've created hey there's uber right what's uber oh it's a wall street company uh owned mainly by saudis right that pays his drivers garbage slave labor really but some people don't have a choice they have to do it right so there don't believe in uh the way they're rolling this out didn't mean for you to go on a rant but thanks for the answer laugh out loud box my pleasure i don't know which one that was monopoly money launder cycle kid to kid takes loan gets a degree in useless humanities rent rants on twitter tries to belittle that didn't go to high high high-end college is unable to get a real job gets a job to teach that useless subjects produces more useless kids like him those kids continue the cycle pretty much pretty much